Hello, this is Itachi Uchiha, and we are here today at the request of my good friend Naruto Uzumaki. How's it going, ma'am? So today, we're here to talk about this guy. Well, not really him. Well, we're here to talk about Mr. Christopher Lane and that World War II veteran that was murdered by these black pieces of shit. Well, one of them, well, I think it went, one of them was black, one of them was caramel, and then the other one was white, well, like, dark white. But, anyway, let's talk about this. Let's really have an intelligent, logical discussion about this. They were teenagers who killed these people because they were bored. They were bored, everyone, so they decided to go play Grand Theft Auto in the real world and just brutally murder these two innocent people. And for what? Because they were bored? Oh, you people need to bite me. Why the hell do we tolerate this nonsense? This is why black people- This is why some people say I'm racist against black people. This is why. This shit right here. Because I speak my mind on this crap. I ask, why the hell do these people always commit these crimes? It's nonsense. Why do all the black motherfuckers get together and say, Hey, let's go blow someone's head off and turn my gun sideways to look cool. Why the hell do they do that? It's pointless. Why, why, why the hell don't you see Asian guys going out and murdering people all the time? Do you know why? It's because Asian people are really smart, and they can go get jobs. Now, black people can go get jobs. Uh, there's half of them are in the NFL, and they've been arrested three times, but the point is, peep, anybody can do anything if they work. These people don't want to work. They're the laziest culture. That's why they commit so many fucking crimes. Because they want to take the lazy way out. They All they want to do, they don't want to work. They don't want to go get their college degree. John Wall can fucking skip college. They don't want to work. What these people think work is above them. They think they're above everything. They were just bored. They don't want to work. They just want to take the easy way out and go rob banks. It's... And, why, and they just... And they in the street gang nonsense pisses me off too. And they and the, the other reason they said they did it was the right complaining about the media nothing about the two the teens black wise lane was white to oppose to the massive alarm bell and the George Zimmerman killing black Trayvon Martin. Okay, so your your theory is that since George Zimmerman D yes, George Zimmerman did kill Trayvon Martin and I do agree that he should have been uh Killed for that, not, not killed, but he should have been found guilty of that. But, but, did you just see me running up to a white man's house and going to shoot their heads off? No. And I don't think, I, I don't think Zimmerman is, is guilty just because it's white against black man. I think Zimmerman was guilty of that because of what Buckley said, I'm gonna be honest. I didn't really, I didn't hear about the Zimmerman trial. I didn't know it existed until I watched watch Buckley cover it. But the thing is, this and this shit needs to stop. Whatever the, it, and the, the whatever these people think in their minds, it's wrong. Whatever you, whatever people, whatever you people are thinking before you commit a crime, it's wrong. And deep down, you know it's wrong. So don't do it. Why do you go through with it? I just don't get it. You think you're gonna lose everything? Just move halfway across the globe and start over. It's not that hard. Oh my god. And now let's bring to the next question. So, let's see here. I really couldn't. They were. Sh he was shot, right? Yeah. Violence, every staple. Blah, 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 blah. I wanna hear. Did he get shot? I think if they said he was shot. Only two black guys who doused the white 13 year old gasoline lit him on fire. Nice. Nice. Here, let's. Uh, I'm gonna start making the points right now just to save some time. So let's say for right now that he was shot. I think he was shot, but now I have him like a mind blank. 
in the racist dimension of crime. <laughs> okay, so Chris Lane shot. Let's put that. Yes, okay. So, let's see. So, let me get this straight. These black teenagers, like James Francis Edwards Jr., 15. How do these teenagers get guns? How does that fucking happen? How does a 15-year-old black boy get a gun? It doesn't make any sense to me. Why do you people think gun control is a bad idea? I don't get. Uh, I'm not. Even, I, I would. I'm gonna save you ten minutes and explain why I think gun control is a good idea. Again, I don't care what you people think about Obama's gun control laws. I agree with them. Just because it's in the Constitution, that doesn't make it right. The Constitution could have been wrong. They could have made a mistake. You don't know that. They don't know how to run a country. These. George Washington was the first president. There was no experiment, like, there was no guy before him. When the, when the rights were written, they had nothing to go upon. George Washington and Thomas Jefferson couldn't look into the future and say, Oh, we're going to have a big gun problem. No, but they could have been wrong. And that's fine. They did so many things right that they're allowed to be wrong. And so, Obama thinks, I guess Obama thinks they're wrong. I think they're wrong. I think the right to bear arms is a bunch of horse shit. So, so what's wrong with running around government? I think the government should run through the aisles of all the countries, rob the guns. I think they should do that. The gun, a, a gun should, there should be psychiatric testing before guns are given to people. There should be analysis of this person's background before replacing a firearm in their hands. It's a bunch of crap. This poor innocent man and that World War II veteran were killed because of this gun control shit. And it's starting to really piss me off. I am sick of these shootings. I am sick of these murders. Take the guns away! Please, for the love of crap, take the guns away. Burn them! Well, no, not burn them. Keep them. But only give the gun to a law official, goddammit. Only give the guns to the military. Some random black gangster shouldn't be having a pistol to turn sideways. It's nonsense. Oh, my God. Oh, I don't... And I'm not gonna go too much into detail about the World War II veteran. I just know they did it because they were bored. Bored, I'm, well, I'm bored. I'm gonna go murder someone. That seems like a great idea. You know, guess what you're gonna be doing behind your cell every day, pal? You're gonna be bored. Then you can stick your face, drink the toilet water, and get a disease and die. Do the world a favor and just die. These people make me sick. This, the, the, how does a teenager get a gun? If, 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 that's what I want to know. When someone says they like shooting and they're 17 years old, that's nonsense. That is a bunch of nonsense. Anybody that is under the age of 22 that has ever shot a gun should be killed off before they kill somebody. It's complete shit. And instead of fixing the problem, we get this whole 3D printed gun shit. Does anybody realize how we're moving backwards with this whole 3D printed gun shit? Hey, people were shot in the Dark Knight Theater. Let's go shoot a pee. It only gets one bullet. All it takes is one. One shot right between the eyes. Hit them right between the eyes. Hit them right between the eyes. And they're gone. And so I say goodbye. Goodbye. So long. Nice try. I'm gone. You don't like being second. I don't like being wrong, I won't forget the way you made me feel, I won't regret running away from here. Oh, sorry, sorry, I got a little sidetracked. But, that's the point of this, people. These people were killed by garbage. All this garbage needs to be wiped out. 
All these gangs need to be the, get the SWAT team sent on them and get wiped out. The gangs need to go extinct, goddammit. When the gangs are wiped out, there'll be no more of the shit. Once we get once we get the motorcycle gangs having bullets in between their eyes and feeding their carcasses to a bunch of lions in Africa, ripping their torsos off. Yeah, that's that's what I call improvement. I don't care what the color of your skin is. When you're sh when you're going when you're part of a gang, you deserve to have the SWAT team come, tie your legs in a knot, rip them off, and feed you to the local zoo's grizzly bear. Okay? So, see you later. I hope you learned something from this.